Hello everyone, I'm Ian from Creative Visuals and for today's video I just have a quick tutorial for you guys on how to batch export in Premiere. So basically if you want to have a whole timeline filled of clips and you want to export some of them individually, maybe for a client who just wants some specific clips and you don't feel like going in and exporting everything and then cropping it or rendering in to out and then having to cut it up, this is how you export individual clips from your Premiere timeline. Let's get right into it. Okay, so jumping into Premiere here, as you can see, I have some, my footage all in the timeline, all ready to go. I'm actually uploading this to Blackbox, which is a stock footage site. If you want to learn more about that, I will have some videos coming up and I'll also leave a sign up link down in the description below. But anyways, basically for this, you always want to export your clips individually. And originally I was just exporting the entire timeline, a whole day's worth of shooting. And then I was going through and individually trimming out each video using QuickTime and then uploading them and that's just very time consuming and not very efficient knowing now that there is a much better way to do that which is what I'm going to show you right now. So in the timeline here you can see that I have it all chopped up so if you do have anything that's overlapping even an adjustment layer you're going to want to make sure that you cut it up as you see here and make sure that they're in line and then from here all you're going to want to do is nest all the individual clips that you want to export individually. So I actually use the shortcut just N on my keyboard so all I do is select the clips like so press N and enter and as you can see in this project I am already to nested clip 36 because I've done this before I use this every time that I go and do black box so basically you're just gonna want to run through here and just nest all your clips so I'm gonna do that now and as soon as I'm done we're gonna get right to the end of this video showing you how to batch export these next Okay, so as you can see, I have now nested all my clips together, all the individual clips that I want to export, well, as individual video files. So next up, all we are going to do is come down here to your project and find the very first clip. So as you can see, if I zoom in here, it's nested clip 35 because I have done this before in this project, but for you, it'll most likely be nested clip one. But anyways, you choose the first clip that you are going to export and press on it. Go all the way down to the bottom to the last clip that you've nested that you want to export. Hold shift and click it. So now they are all selected. Now from here, you're just going to press control or command M and it's going to bring up the options to export them. So now you're just going to choose whatever kind of file format you're going to export in. I'll set mine up here real quick. So as you can see, I have mine all set up here, ready to go in ProRes. And now all I'm gonna do is just press Q at the bottom. And as you can see, it's gonna open up Adobe Media Encoder. And one by one, it's gonna put these clips in and have them ready to export. Okay, so as you can see, all of the, my clips that I just had in my timeline are now in Adobe Media Encoder, all ready to go. As you can see, they're all as I set them and they're saving to the place that I wanted them to, all individually. So if I press the little play button here now, it's going to one by one encode these videos to the destination I put, which is in my documents folder. And once they're done, there's going to be all these individual clips straight off my timeline, all well, individual rather than in a whole long video so I hope this helps you guys out for any time that you need to individually export clips from your Adobe Premiere Pro timeline thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video and if you stayed all the way to the end you get to know I am wearing my coat because it's cold in my basement thank you guys for watching and I'll talk to you in the next one bye